The stagnation of the population and the economy, the religious wars and wars for European dominance seem to justify the 17th century being known as a tragic century. It was for Spain. These are the times of the military decadence of France in the continent and of England in the seas. Also of its internal breakdown through secessions in Catalonia and Portugal. Something that contrasts with the splendor of literature in Castilian. For Navarre, however, these are times of political and identity strength and the emergence of its own historiography. Corn and remittances of rich returning migrants arrive from America. This is the Baroque century and that of the Catholic offensive against the Protestant world. This is translated into the linguistic world. Rome drives forward the evangelization of the people in their own language. Despite Latin persisting in holy books and in liturgy, bilingual catechisms appear in Basque and Romance. Ignored by the administration and the school, the Basque language only receives a hint of acknowledgement in the church and in homes. Education in Castilian spreads across the villages of Navarre in detriment to Basque. Castilian in the south and French in the north, driven by the machinery of powerful monarchs, both take on prestige and dominance. The Basque language, which continues to be a spoken language, becomes identified with the countryside. Little by little, as with all popular elements, it falls into disrepute because of the expansion of the elite ideology impregnated with rationalism and science.